Hello guys and welcome to another video. This is the third and last part of the CSS Garden where you learn about the grid system by playing a cool game. I'll leave in the description box the URL for the game as long as my solutions and all my previous videos about CSS, about grid garden, sorry, um, will be also in the description box. So now I'm going to begin from uh, level 20 as I did uh, the previous levels in other videos. So let's start. Up to this point you've had your garden set up as a grid with uh, 5 columns, it's 20% of the full width and the same for uh, the rows. This was done by the rules grid template columns 20, 20, 20, 20 and again the same for the rows. But you can set the grid up however you like, use grid template columns, ok. And you value to water your cards, you'll want to set the width of the first column to 50%. Okay, let's do that. I guess I'm just going to need um, to write 50% five times and then that's it. So let's go to level 21. Uh, luckily there is a repeat function to help with that. I know it's quite boring writing the same thing uh, 20 times. So, for example, we previously defined five 20% columns with the rule grid template columns 20, 20, 20, 20, and this can simplify it as repeat five um, of 20%. So now it says to do the same, but uh, use the function repeat, and we will do that eight for eight columns, each with 20 per 12, sorry, percent. So I need 8 and 12.5%. Um, okay, is that right? Uh, let me think. Well, now it is. Level 22. Grid template columns doesn't just accept values in percentages, but also length units like uh, pixels and EM. Here it's a 3 columns to 100 pixel 3M and 40%. Okay, 100 pixels and 3EM and 40%. That was easy. Level 23. Grid also introduces a new unit, the functional FR. Its FR unit allocates one share of the available space. For example, if two elements are set to one fraction and three fraction respectively, the space is divided into four equal shares. The first element occupies the one out of four and the second element three out of four of any leftover space. So we will do the same for one out of six in first row and the remaining five out of six using uh, the fraction. All right. I'm going to have 1 and then I'm going to have 5. Cool. And it's level 24. When columns are set with pixels, percentages or EMs, any other column set with fraction will divide up the space that's left over. So here are the cards from a 50 pixel column on the left and the width of 50 pixel column on the right. Use grid template columns, create these two columns and use fraction to make three more columns that uh, take up the remaining space in between. So I need 50 uh, pixels to the left and 50 pixels to the right, but in between I need um, three of one fraction. Cool. Level 25. Now there is a uh, 75 pixel columns of width on the left side of your garden, and three out of five of the remaining space is grown in carrots, while two out of five has been overrun with widths. Use grid template columns with a combination of pixels and fraction units to make the necessary uh, columns. Okay, I will uh, first use the 75 pixels and then the 3 fraction and 2 
and I think that is also correct. So let's go to level 26. Grid templates rows uh, works much as grid templates columns. Use grid templates rows to water all but the top 50 pixels of your garden. Note that the water is said to fill only your fifth row, so you'll need to create five rows in total. Okay, so first I will need to do these like rows and then I will have my uh, 50 pixels, I guess. And somehow I need to create mm, the total of five uh, rows. So I'm going to do like zero, 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 because this will take the whole place. So let's test this. And yeah, it's great. So grid template is a shorthand property that combines grid templates, rows and columns. For example, grid template 50% 50% for um, 200 pixels will create a grid with two rows that are 50% each and one column that is 200 pixels wide. So I'm going to use the grid template to water an area that includes the top 60% and left 200 pixels so I'm going to have my 60 pixels and then my 200 uh, pixels sorry that's not pixels it's actually percentage yep okay give me one last level which is 28 your garden is looking great I know I know here you've left a 50, 50 pixel path at the bottom of your garden and filled the rest with cards. Uh, unfortunately, the left 20% of your cards have been overrun with weeds. Use yes as greed one last time to treat your garden. So I'm going to use grid template. Um, I know that I have to divide it. I think I uh, will need my 50 pixels and certainly my 20% which means that I would need one fraction here and one fraction sorry fraction here and yes that's it so thank you guys for watching um, I hope you enjoyed this small series about uh, grid garden and please uh, share and subscribe thank you